Hey, screeners, how you doing? It's me, the one AJ, Anthony Jordan. And me, Nico Lero. And if you're joining us, it means you're here to see a retro slash classic movie review. AJ. Yeah, that's, that's the, the one, guys. Now. We're going back in the decades. We're celebrating a film who's turning the special zero this year. What is that zero? Is it 10? Is it 20? Is it 30? Is it 40? Is it beyond? I don't know, but you do. <laughs> that's essentially the, the case of it. Um, sometimes I've seen it, sometimes I haven't. And sometimes it really You've seen this one. I have. You've seen this one, and it's something we both really like. Um, you know what? Actually, I say that I wouldn't wait wager my house on it, but I, I'd put a lot of money on the fact that you've seen this. Okay. Disclaimer: AJ never knows what movie we're about to talk about. You guys do. You've clicked on the video. You've seen the title of the video. AJ never knows what the movie is. AJ, today we're going back. 30 years. It's an old Yes, film. Emilio Estevez. I don't know. Hey, That's his brother. Quack. 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 Do you know what? D2. The Do Mighty Ducks. Do you know what? It's a damn good thing you didn't put your house on the line. I have not seen a Ducks movie. I have not seen a single Mighty Duck movie. Yeah. Yeah. The, what? <laughs> How is this yeah. possible? They have eluded me for the long time. What's always happened with Mighty Ducks is when they would come on TV, it would be like D2 or D3. And I'm like, I want to see it from the beginning. Kind of like Karate Kid. I remember seeing like the end of Karate Kid 3. And then eventually I went to Karate Kid and then I started to move. I've just got Karate, Karate Kid start. is the first one. Coming up, but I, only good karate kid uh, is the yeah. first one. I, I, I've got a little bit of redemption for all of them, but um, when it comes to Mighty Ducks, I've just not got round to doing it. It's just one Dude, of those they're like, so fun. They're so fun. Listen, they do very much have like if they were released now, they would be straight to streaming, you know, they wouldn't be released in the cinema. They these very much do feel like TV movies, um, but they're great, man. Like, so. It, Here's the thing, right? So the first Mighty Ducks movie, you had Emilio Estevez playing Coach Bombay, and he was managing kind of a Pee Wee League's team. With D2, which is crazy to me that the second one is 30 years old this week, but hey-ho, there you go. With D2, Coach Bombay has been promoted, and he's not just managing Pee Wee Mighty Ducks. He's managing USA, USA. He's managing Team USA. But what he's done is he's taken a load of his... The peewees into his the peewees, team. and they've gone on to the USA team. He's brought in a few new faces too, which are awesome. Um, but they've got these really cool kind of gimmicks, all of them. You know, you've got your captain, you've got the Bash Brothers, the Brothers of Destruction, you've got these brilliant goalkeepers. Um, they've they, they've all got kind of weird one-dimensional but fun characteristics as players. And the nice thing about D2 is that, the, is that the players kind of lose their way. They lose sight of what made them special in the first place, you know? And they come up against teams like Iceland, who, I mean, just wipe the floor with them. And it's like, oh, dear. <laughs> this ain't the Ducks anymore, is it? Um, Keenan Thompson, a very young Keenan Thompson, is in this. He joins Team USA. He's got a specialist shot called the knuckle puck shot. It's very cool. Um, but you, you see kind of what they get the kind of slap, hmm, slap shot, slapstick humor we're going with. Um, it's, it's, it's a nice feel good sporting story of redemption. And I very much feel like the mighty ducks. I mean, your proof of this AJ is one that's kind of been lost to the annals of time, but it's really quite fun. And it's on Disney plus now. Fun fact. There was a really goofy but awesome animated spin-off show from the Mighty Ducks, but it was actually kind of space ducks. And they came and did all sorts of badass. It's really weird, but really fun. There's an actual animated show called The Mighty Ducks with actual ducks. badass ducks in it. Like, I know, wrap your head around that one. I know, badass ducks, it's a thing. Just work with me on it. But D2, you should definitely see. It's a barrel of fun. Um, yeah, well, hit me with this trailer, bro. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. 
champions. Is, is it playing or not? Yeah, yeah. For me, it is not. Yeah. The Mighty Ducks are back. Their game is as good as ever. No, it's not. Have you guys been training in the offseason? I know we forgot something. But they're adding some new players. Yeah! And now, they're heading to California. For the, the World Bash Championships. Brothers, yes. This year, the team to beat is Iceland. Oh, we'll see you on the ice. Ice is bigger. Stronger. Ah! <laughs> but if they want to go for the gold, they'll have to learn to become a team again. Move together! We came here as a team, and we're leaving here as a team. Right! Three more, we're ready! Emilio Estevez. Stand tall! Fly straight! USA! All the way! <laughs> There's the knuckle pop. Walt Disney Home Video presents D2. The Mighty Ducks are back. Now available on video cassette. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, dude, I'll say this. I'll, I'll, I'll say this. Um, that trailer made the movie look more joyful than it actually is. It has those joyful beats. There's a lot more drama to it than that trailer led on. Um, if I'm not mistaken, right, and this is really shooting in the dark because I've not seen uh, any of these films, because he took the the peewees, as it were, and brought them to the big leagues, I suppose your your trailer has to show people they're back. They won. They were the nobodies. They were the underdogs, and now they're they're, they're doing it for USA. It's very hard to be able to sell that with drama. Yes. I believe so. That probably is why the trailer made it look that way. You fair. Know? That's a fair observation. Um, but yeah, it's it's there is drama to it. It's not just I hate using this expression. I almost want to wash my mouth out before I've even said. Lucky? That one. Thank you for not making me say it. Um, yeah, it, it, it's that. It's that, 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 that term that doesn't mean anything that everyone seems to understand. Um, the, trailers, the trailer shows that there's a lot more to the movie than that. Like there's some genuine bad blood between uh, Coach Bombay, Emilio Estevez, and the coach of the Iceland team. It's... You know, it's a bit edge of the sea, the USA Iceland Iceland match at the end. But it's a fun damn watch, man. One thumb up, I can't give it two because it is ultimately as a nearly 40-year-old man, I watch this and I'm like, okay, it's very much a children's film. Were I nine years old doing this, it would get this. Absolutely. <laughs> if I was nine, this would get two thumbs up for me. Hundred percent. I mean, look, it's very hard to comment on something I've not seen. It look, they're on my, they're on my bucket list. The, the ducks have always been on my bucket list. So do it. Listen, it's not through beef. It's just through time. It's genuinely mm. through that. Like, it's, it's, it's one of those. But who knows? It may just happen sooner than that. Do the ducks, come on. <laughs> um, what about you guys? What? How old are you? How old are you? That was a very personal question. Um, what age range are you in that you do or don't remember the Mighty Ducks? That's what I'm interested to know. Have you seen it? And if you have, then I want to know how old you are. I want to know for people who are in our generation. Have you, you seen it? it? Well, I mean, no, they, they, everyone's seen it. I, I know I'm in a very, very, very small minority when this happens. But I want to know, Are you? do, do people think Nico's being harsh? Are you allowed to say it's two thumbs up even though you're nearly 40 or you are in the 40 bracket? Let us know. I'd like to know. That's what intrigues me. Because I've always had a lot of love about the Mighty Ducks. Just never got to do it. Just because mm. of my way to AJ ism sort of having to see the first film first. But yeah, I'd like to hear from you guys. Let us know. How many thumbs up does this film really deserve? And once you let us know, please do be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you right here on the Silver Screen Dudes for another classic movie review. We're out, guys. Bye for now. See, see ya. ya.